Hello and welcome to Oathbird. In this episode, we are going to discuss about how can we get a full driving transaxle from a single planetary gear with an oil pump and oil motor. A planetary gear contains a sun gear, planetary gears, and a ring gear. Planetary gears are connected to the planet carrier. The oil pump is going to be driven by the input shaft and oil motor is going to be connected to the output shaft. The input shaft is going to be connected on the sun gear and the output shaft is connected on the planetary gear. If we put a block to fill this space between the planetary gears, we can have an oil flow uh, depending on the direction of the rotation of the gears. For example, if we have an anti-clockwise direction for the input and we are going to have a neutral gear selected, the planet carrier will stop rotating and the, the gears is moving anti-clockwise. So we are going to have high pressure areas in these two places and low pressure areas in these two. But if we want to ac slowly accelerate the car, we are going to limit the amount of flow in these four areas, which is going to conclude a dynamic friction on the system. This dynamic friction will allow it to rotate the whole planet carrier based on the rotation of the sun gear. As we limit the flow, the high pressure areas will increase their pressure and the low pressure areas will increase their, uh, their vacuum but it will cause the whole device to rotate. How are we going to do that efficiently? In order to limit the flow, we have to use an oil motor. Because if we simply use a, a high pressure valve or limit the pressure, we are going to, going to waste the energy. Instead of the wasting energy, we are going to use an oil motor to drive the output shaft. The oil motor is variable, so how can we choose reverse? The oil pump will pump the oil in reverse direction. This will allow to have faster rotation in outer, uh, in the ring gear, which is in, in outer part. The faster rotation will allow the planet carrier to rotate in opposite direction. The oil pump and the oil motor is both variable. The oil pump will uh, slowly increase the flow as it needs on the planet carrier, planet carrier. And the oil motor will uh, slowly limit the flow until the whole planetary drive set rotates as a unique part.